aim of the competition is to stimulate an interest in science and engineering and considering a, a future career path in one of those disciplines by giving students a set of fun and hands-on activities that they can um, work on over the course of the day and also they're working in a competitive environment as well so they've got that little competition edge that, that uh, certainly drives their level of enthusiasm. So it's looking at students that are heading into year 11 and 12 to sort of help them get a little bit more of an idea about the kind of subjects they might be interested in doing when they go on to their more senior studies. Um, yeah, it's been really good and it's a good learning experience. And I'm going to do engineering studies in year 12, 11 or 12 for the HSC. I, I would find it really helpful. I just came for the experience to see what it's all like. The, just the day was fun. It was a good chance to work well with friends. And of course, it, all, it was always be nice to uh, win, hopefully, and go on to the next stage. But I think mainly the experience of you know just being at the university and putting skills together with friends would be one of the biggest things. Um, well, we just built an airship in um, search for the Lost World activity. So we had to fly that through a course. Yeah. I'm just new experience, and uh, I was just looking into engineering and all the different things that you can do in it. Involved in concepts of science and engineering, hopefully to motivate them to do those kind of subjects in uh, later high school. There's anything from building an airship out of paddle pop sticks and balloons and making that fly electronically, uh, to building a bridge that will withstand a, a significantly heavy load. These days, too many of them are, I think, watching the TV or else operating their little iPods and they are not using their hands, whereas this, as well as using their brains, they're, they're hands-on. They have to really be able to do something physically. Um, it's been pretty easy at the start, but we've encountered a few problems as it's gone on. What sort of problems? Um, the helium from the balloons has come out, so we actually need to add more balloons, which has added more time to our, and actually lowered our general score.